Yeah, hey, coming up, Philly's own boxing champion right now, Stephen Fulton, who grew up in North Philly. He's traveling halfway around the world to Japan for his toughest fight yet. I'm solidifying my name in the, in the history books of Philadelphia. Stephen Fulton grew up in North Philly. He had a tough upbringing. He saw friends die. He was around crime, drugs, and violence. Boxing may have saved his life. Boxing became his release for the anger that he had seeing a lot of suffering. Stephen believes that Philly boxers have a different mentality that sets them apart. You know, just to be from Philadelphia means everything to me. Uh, I feel like every fight that I go in, uh, I big up Philadelphia. I wear Philadelphia on my back, and you know, we, everybody said well, we the grit, and we had that you know determination to win, and you know, I'm coming for the win. But that win would be the toughest in his career. He's undefeated, 21 and 0. He's the unified WBC and WBO champ. He is the world unified super bantamweight world champion. But he is the underdog going to Japan. You don't get a lot of people that go and do the things that I'm doing right now. Like I'm, I'm actually defending my world title in another country with nothing to gain, but all to defend. That's right. This is basically a road game for the champ from Philly. He's facing a guy they call a monster, Naoya Inoue, and he has to face Naoya on his home turf. Destructive work from the monster. Knockout victory for the great Naoya. If Stephen Fulton wins, he just may be considered one of the best pound-for-pound -pound boxers in the world. So with the win, this will solidify me, not just in the pound-for-pound rings, but in the, in the whole boxing world, you know, and I'm making history, like I said before. Yeah, we are 12 days away from Stephen Fulton's huge fight in Japan. He's trying to make his name, and we just saw him tweet out within the last 10 hours, we make in history. So mm -hmm. a road game. Underdog sounds like the Philly way to do it, right? Yeah, with grit going into yep. the lion's den. Absolutely. We wish him the best. All right. Thank you, John.